I, I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I, mean, I got the concept that like your brain has to Yeah, I can't figure it out. Every time I think too hard about it, I can't do it anymore. I'm just like, wait. What do you want to do for this week's episode? I don't know. I'm not sure. There's like, so many there's just there's so many things that we could do. We just we just need a fresh idea. There are. I just I just it's this time of year too, like it's cold outside, there's not a lot of things. Hey look, it's my buddy Randy though, the street sign dancer. You know that guy? Yeah, remember he, we, he helped me look for you when we went to Comic Con. Oh, that's right. I wonder if he'll let us do some street sign dancing. Hey. Hi guys. Do you want to Do you want to teach us how to street sign dance? That'd be awesome. Totally, yeah. Think it's easy? Come check it out, yeah. It'd be awesome to come out and uh, have a couple other sidekicks. I have extra signs. You guys want something going, right? Let's okay. do it. That'd be awesome. Let's go. Oh yeah, anytime. Imagine that. Good old Randy. Imagine that. Good old Randy. That's very, very cheesy. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> Imagine that. It works. No one, was, no one was saying anything. <laughs> no, that's so awkward. It's all good though. <laughs> all right. That works though. Hey guys, I'm Bobby. And I'm Megan. And this is Randy. Randy, tell us what you do. Well, for the past eight years, I've been uh, advertising for companies all over five different counties, all the way up to the Wasatch Front. Uh, I've done like 40 companies, politicians, charity events. Because apparently when I started dancing for Domino's eight years ago down the corner down there, people saw me and they thought, this is unique, this is a different kind of a way of getting people's attention. So yeah, people just hired me off the street. So you're a professional street sign dancer? Oh yeah, it was crazy when I first got hired by my first real gig there at Village Inn in West Jordan. Like my first day, I was like, I'm getting paid to do this. This makes me a professional dancer, this is weird. <laughs> That is, that is amazing. So you, like, legit, this is like what you do for a living. This is what I do. People actually find me on the street. They actually know my name before I know who they are. People actually called out my name, <laughs> strangers, wow. and they asked me to do birthday parties. I've done birthday parties. So you're just crazy. like an icon. <laughs> right? I've kind of, yeah, it's weird. It's like, yeah, I remember running into you at Comic-Con when we were looking at, well, uh, looking for Megan. And I was looking for Megan trying you to find You were lost. Her. I was lost. <laughs> you were like, Hey guys, if you're from Utah, you'll recognize these, this guy. He's Randy, the street side dancer. Randy, have you seen Megan, dude? I've been looking all over for her. I don't know if she's here yet or not. I heard that she was down with a little cold, but I don't know where she is. She's Man. like hiding. All right, well, are you still down to do a Think It's Easy being a street side dancer? Oh, heck yeah, dancer? I'm totally down with doing a thing with you guys street dancing. Awesome. Perfect, thanks brother. Awesome, you guys All are right. great. <laughs> Amazing. Perfect. Like, so what, what kind of advice would you give people that are wanting to do this? I just be daring, be daring, be, you know, I mean, to me, it was like I said, it kind of fell into this. Um, and it was, it was scary at first, but once you get out there and you see the responses you get, you just kind of feed off that. Just be daring, don't be afraid, you know? It's it so cool to, to have a job where you just get to be yourself and be silly and, and just get that kind of attention and be right? like, hey, well, and come like, to my place of work. It's funny you mentioned Comic-Con, because like literally the very first Comic-Con we had here in Utah, big record-breaking year for Comic-Con. Um, I just went out there because I've been doing this for so many years. I just went out there and did it impromptu. Like, I wasn't even paid. I was just like, I'm going to dress up in cosplay, make a sign. I even drew my own signs up because I'm an artist. Drew my own signs up and just danced there. And they just now become a staple. They think I work for Comic Con. I'm just hilarious. <laughs> That's amazing. That's great. So, yeah, it was, it's been a ride. That's really cool. So, what, what challenge do you have for us today? Well, the challenge for today is the easiest thing, and hopefully in this corner we can do that. It's a little less traffic than some of my other corners, but you want to get someone to honk at you. Because okay. I get honked okay. at a lot, I get filmed a lot. It's kind of hard to see if they're filming you, but you, if we see it, we'll point it out. But let's see if we can get someone to honk at you guys. And maybe we'll see who can get honked at first. Okay. okay. That'd be kind of cool, right? Challenge, Challenge accepted. accepted. <laughs> awesome. I'm, gr I'm excited. Right, it's going to be great. Let's do this. Wow, guys, you look ready to do this thing. You ready? Let's go. Let's do this. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do... I'm going to hand you this sign, and you guys are going to take turns, and we're going to time you, and the first person that gets a honk quickest wins the uh, challenge. All right. about that? Who's going to go first? You get to go first. <laughs> <laughs> you win. All right. Let's do this. Okay, I get it. <laughs> yeah, it just stops for no reason. Oh, 
probably do the faster side. <laughs> Slow jams. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna do a fast side. You get them to wave, it's done or hot. Cause it's gonna get hot in here. How you feeling? You feeling pretty confident with your time? Tell me when to go. May the force be with you. Say it one more time. May the force be with you. Okay, ready, set, go. Is that a horn? That was is that for horn. you? Is that a horn? Yeah! <laughs> that was for me. I heard a horn. I heard a horn. <laughs> Guys, pro tip number two, make sure you dress for the occasion. It's winter time right now and I am cold even though I'm dancing around right now. So guys, that was pretty good. I mean, for the first time, right? You see how challenging it can be, right? To get people's attention. Yeah, not uh, only that, but, but dancing, the cardio that you do in an eight hour eight day hours days, yeah. is it's ridiculous. It's crazy. It would be so fun, but like, I was already, I was like. <gasps> My longest uh, shift, I did it seven hours and 50 minutes nonstop. That is non-stop. Non non I have like a break. cramp in my side. <laughs> Would you do you prefer working like in the in the middle of summer or the middle of winter? Oh, I'm torn. I love spring and fall. Obviously, they're the best. Um, summer can be really hard because actually you get really really hot, overheated, and I don't sweat unless I'm really working out. So I got to drink a lot of water. Usually, I have my 100 ounce mug with me, and it's crazy because, like I said, it's it's so sweltering. Yeah. Winters can be hard only because it's cold, but the best thing about winters is I can layer up more and get warmer. So sometimes summer's a little bit harder, believe it or not. Yeah, the more you dance it, the warmer you'll get. Yeah, so. right? So, yeah. But did we do okay? Oh, you guys did great. All right. You got good responses. I saw a lot of smiles. People were really digging it. They love the costumes, obviously. So who won the challenge? It looks like our buddy over here won the challenge at 159 versus 2. 34, unfortunately. I do love the uh, mask, that's amazing. That's really my favorite. You gotta tell me, Randy, what is the craziest thing you had somebody do? Craziest thing I had somebody do, bad or good? You talking bad or good? <laughs> Just the craziest. Craziest, someone almost ran me off the roof. Whoa! Actually, it was even crazier than that. They ran up onto the sidewalk, took out my A-frame sign, and missed me by inches. Whoa! I don't know if it was on purpose, Goodness gracious! <laughs> gotta, let, gotta let the viewers know. Is it easy? This is a great way to pick up chicks. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, they'll give me their business cards on the street corner. <laughs> Pretty awesome. So yeah. That's Pretty amazing. Huh? So yeah. I was just kidding, but sure. <laughs> Well guys, if you want Randy, the street side dancer, to come to your local business and advertise for you, uh, all this information will be down in the description box below so you can contact him. And uh, if you guys like the video, what do you got to do? Smash that like button, <laughs> smash that like subscribe the video. Come on, button, guys. and share it with your friends. Right? And dance awesome. the whole time. Oh, dance. Yes. Uh, uh, yeah. dance. You got to dance. <laughs>